Uh, SoCal Hero. SoCal Hero. Hitbox Tyrant. Where's SoCal at? Of course, that's where we are right now. <laughs> if you can't tell, uh, obviously local legend, uh, top 8 at EVO. Uh, he's, he dominated the scene uh, in Injustice and in Mortal Kombat. Super high level player. And of course, his opponent, uh, coming out of Australia, Tony T. And what Tony T is really famous for is uh, his combos and his tech. He, I mean, a lot of the tech that was attributed to uh, Mortal Kombat 9 and Injustice, right? from his uh, combo videos. Yeah, exactly. He's put in a bunch of work uh, over the years, very well known for that. And, um, you know, he's, he's coming into this without quite as much high-level tournament experience as most of the other players. Look, for quite a while, the game was illegal in his country. Yeah, okay, that's so crazy. I'll give him a little bit of slack. But, <laughs> uh, but um, that, that's going to be something that we'll, we'll see if he can overcome. Tyrant, though, that, that's not a problem. Like you said, he's been competing for a while. He's been very, very high-level and dominant for a while. Yeah, definitely a seasoned veteran. He's done a lot of traveling. He's been out to the Midwest, the East Coast. So uh, this is definitely uh, his, his uh, not his first rodeo, as they say. Yeah, that's right. Well, as far, as far as Tony goes, I'm really interested to see what kind of work he's been putting in. I've, I've seen him in the back there. He's been playing Raiden. Uh, has some really nice damaging combos. We'll see if he can get you know, that, that, that kind of stuff in, in the match. Look, looking forward to that. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of, there's a small, I mean, they, I know they only had two days, but there's a small yeah. part of me hoping that this this insane, ridiculous, yeah. like, one-minute combo comes out at 95%. Well, uh, we'll, <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Uh, as far as, as Tyrant goes, one of the things that I'm most impressed by his play is the fact that he just never gives up. It says they're known for big comebacks. Some of the, the most incredible comebacks that I can recall in fighting games are from Tyrant. Uh, in, in Injustice with, with Grundy, he would make pixel comebacks. Literally. Miracle pixel comebacks. Uh, so he, he never gives up. He never feels like he's out of it. No, he's, he's such an exciting player to watch because of that. Uh, you, you feel like he's never out of the game. Yeah. And I think also uh, when people play him, they know this. Yes. And they'll, they'll, they'll spend the extra bar meter, do what they got to do just to finish the kid. Well, we had a chance to talk with both of the players about this tournament and their matches. Let's go to that now. Honestly, Mortal Kombat just, it has a special place in my heart. You know, it's, it's a man, I think it's the most manly fighting game out there, honestly. Everybody loves it, everybody plays it, you know. So I just, I just love it. And I'll play, I'll play every variation. Even if it does if it's not competitive, I'll play it anyway. It's just, I'm a fan. So my very first entrance into the scene uh, was my local scene. It was EGP. Went to his very first local, ended up winning, and then I just fell in love with, with competing and on the offline scene for Mortal Kombat. So. Oh, unbelievably hyped, man. As soon, as soon as I got the call, as soon as I got the interview, I was just, I was ready to play. So, like, this has been truly an amazing experience. Like, it's humbling experience for sure, you know. It's just so it, it made me really appreciate how far I've come as a competitive fighting gamer and as a person, you know. So, I would never see myself being here, and this has been nothing but great. So, so if you play a bad matchup, you can just pick another variation of your character without having to switch a character. Maybe you don't like them, so you can use them still, and they're still viable. So that's what I really like. Uh, I'm really excited for MKX because the mechanics are different. Um, there's new characters, um, new stages, and just the overall design just is, is upgraded, so it looks really, really nice and smooth. Perfect Legend is just really, really good. You know, as whatever you want to say about him, he's an EVO champion. Sonic Fox is a prodigy. So. I think I look up to them the most, definitely. Uh, the ESL Pro League um, means a lot more opportunity for the players. I think it's going to be really, really great for the scene, competitive and casual players alike. And um, I think I think the guys are doing an amazing, amazing job funding everything, you know, doing it for the community the way it should be. So, shout outs to my sponsors, Hitbox. Uh, shout outs to my training partner, Godspeed. Shout outs to all my family and friends that supported me since day one and uh, the reason why I'm here. So. Uh, when did I first play Mortal Kombat? I think I was 14 years old. I was um, just finished a day at the beach and my mother uh, took us up to a takeaway shop which was just up from the beach and inside this chicken shop was an arcade machine Mortal Kombat. And um, look, I fell in love with it. Um, I've played it uh, for 15, 16 years now, uh, longer even. And um, I think it's great and I think this new iteration of Mortal Kombat is quite possibly the best one yet and I'm really looking forward to 
getting my hands on it, breaking it down, um, you know, just really having a go at it. Oh, I'm very hyped. You know, this is um, an amazing experience, an amazing opportunity. You know, thank you so much for this opportunity. This is um, amazing. I get to meet all these um, great players who I've only seen on YouTube, you know, uh, in tournaments. And, um, you know, being here is, uh, it's kind of special, you know, like uh, only eight of us are here in, out of the entire world. And I'm so glad that, um, you know, like I said, I've got the opportunity to actually come here and experience this with you guys and play the new Mortal Kombat game. And, you know, hopefully I can win. I started doing uh, different moves and came up with all different types of combos. And I started recording them and releasing like small videos to the public. Uh, then I had sort of a hiatus there for a while. And Mortal Kombat 9 came out in 2011. And I uh, just haven't looked back. I've just been doing Mortal Kombat combos ever since. And um, I really enjoy it. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun. Definitely, I would um, be looking into the combos, and I think with the variations, it should be very, very good, so I'm very excited. Um, the Australian scene is quite small, and I'm hoping, like with MKX, that it does actually grow. Our Facebook page has now grown up to about 150 people, so, you know, in the future, I think um, maybe even after the release of MKX, it should actually grow even more, so I'm hoping we do get a competitive scene here in Sydney. Uh, yeah, look, shout-outs to the boys back at home, you know, I know they've been uh, cheering me on. And um, just a quick hi to my girlfriend. And um, yeah, thanks. Welcome back to Fatal Eight. Everybody here in Burbank, how's it going? Are you feeling all right? Okay. How about everybody in London? I can't see you, so I'm gonna have to assume that you're cheering. Also, hey, how about everybody in Paris? Give it up. All right. Hopefully that happened. Pause for a pause. But I'm not sure. Yeah. <laughs> And don't forget, guys, um, follow ES at ESL Mortal Kombat on Twitter, also at NetherRealm. Keep informed of everything that's going on. And don't forget to sign up for the ESL Pro League uh, at esl.gg forward slash MKX Pro League. You can play for money every single week for free. It's amazing. So check that out. We're about to get in the first, ma or the first match between uh, Tyron and Tony here. Well, I, I do think that it's a, it's a tough situation for Tony. Uh, he's been very, very nervous. Hopefully he's settled down a little bit. All right, we're in. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> so, so Jax, of course, it's, it's pumped up Jax. That's what uh, Tyron has been playing this, this whole time. All right, so yeah, in a Thunder God Raiden, Tony has been playing this the whole time as well. So Tony looks pretty good in mid-screen Yeah, here. actually, he, look, he looks great, and this is exactly what he needs. Corner. All right, what do you got? What do you got? Oh, man. Let's make it juicy. The damage. Oh, oh, he does drop it, but gets the throw mix-up. Okay. All right. Maintains control. Jax has full bar. Okay, there's there, there's a, a new thing he has. It's the overhead dash punch. Very cool. Yeah. He can. So usually you could um, try to bait it out. Ooh. Yeah, bait it out neutral duck and right. then punish it. Doesn't work anymore if he goes for that version. Oh, who's going to get the chip? Oh! oh! Wow! Seriously? <laughs> it happens. Oh, okay. I see. There's a little bit of buttons issue. Yes, we do. Oh, have so, so why Dude, let's talk, about, let's talk about Predator DLC. I'm super hyped for that. How can you not be hyped for that? Well, I think... Yeah, that was like one of my favorite movies when I was a bit younger. Yeah. And so I'm, yeah. a, I'm a little bit older than uh, some of the gentlemen here in the crowd, I'm sure, but... That might be true. <laughs> but Predator, but no, I'm really looking forward to seeing what they do with his variations. True, I true. think that's going to be fascinating to see. There's a lot of potential in there for, for really interesting and fun ideas. And Absolutely. you know what? Look, so far in, in, in this match, I don't, I don't feel like Tony T has looked out of it. Um, he, he managed to get the, the chip at the end. That, that's great for him. Yeah, and not right, looks, uh, like, looks like they're back. Not bad damage in the corner either. Right. Yeah. So I mean, first he, round, Tony. He did. He did drop that that combo, but you know, you you can see he's going for something big. Absolutely. All right. This is now a chance. Tyrant Jacks trying to get the corner. Yeah, pushing him back. Oh, saw the back dash and so went in immediately. This is time for pressure. Oh, the big up. Oh, oh red. Still has the standing and goes for the grab. Look at all that bar he's working oh. on still. Here it comes. Oh, oh is that it? Yeah, yeah. That was it. So uh, still has full meter. Yeah, Tyrant looked a lot better. Very cautious approach, and Tony T just feels like he's caged. I think. Yeah, he keeps backing up to the corner. Right, which is not not a great opportunity or not a great idea. Look at that. Especially in the pumped up. 
in this variation, pumped up uh, can be mashed. I love that. The I'm gotcha sorry. Yeah, uh, yeah, gotcha grab, not pumped yeah. up. Well, the pumped up variation. The pumped the up gotcha variation. Grab. Yeah, you were right. Yeah, yeah, there you go. So breaker here. Breaker. From Tony. I don't know, but then not not too much immediately after that. Still caught in the corner. Looks like he's having real trouble getting out of this. Oh, oh meaty! Uh, Tyron just armors through. Oh, the combo. Yo, that was pretty sick. <laughs> <laughs> he waited for him to move too. Really smart by Tyron. Oh, I love this fatality. Oh, he didn't do it. Really? We'll see if he remembers next time. I wish he could hear me right now. <laughs> yeah, he's in that soundproof booth though. Yeah, I'll text him. Alright, so... Again, Tony looked great in that first round. And uh... Yeah, but he just he moved backwards too much. There wasn't enough challenge Agreed. In, in the mid-range. Okay, so may maybe that's what he's trying to do right now. Okay, comes in. That was very nice. That's how you get in right there. Dash is up to try to get some pressure, which is which is a good idea. Look, it didn't work out, but I like that, that change of mindset, that change of approach. Absolutely. Yeah, you don't want to back yourself into the corner. No. Okay, the duck. Yeah. All right, mashes it. It's gonna it it, it restands and he's plus three, so it's a nice situation. Yes. Okay, oh, overhead. Yeah, that's, that's gonna, that's gonna it. do it. Just got to the corner. Complete control once he's there. Yes, absolutely. Tyrant looking um lo looking sharp right now, definitely. Round two, fight. All right, let's see if Tony can make some adjustments here. Yeah, can here. can can he get out of here? Oh, he okay, he does. There's that tech. This is exactly what he needs. Here we go. All right, gets the stand again. Look at that chip. Oh, oh air to air, very him. nice. And converts it. Makes Tyrant break. Very nice. Yeah, I, I think that's smart by Tyrant. He knows the damage output. Right, right. Tyrant pushing his way out. That's how he gets out of the corner. He just... <laughs> yeah, buttons, buttons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it worked. Bullies his way out. Okay, jump kick works again. Oh, it gets the anti there. Now a chance for pressure. Oh, blocked oh, wow. though. Very smart. Yes, absolutely. The EX. Okay, that's the chain. Oh, that oh, jump my kick gosh. is worked. I don't know, three times now. He's just pl placing it very, very well. Absolutely. Yeah, he's stuffing uh, Tyrants down to Ante here. Oh, oh, man. Big mistake. Okay. He did get out of the corner, though. Well, not for long. He's still stuck <laughs> there. <laughs> right back in. Two bars for Tyrant. Armor's out. Very smart. Okay, he gets the throw. You can do that. Really smart there. To put yeah. him back in the corner. Yes, exactly. And look at this damage. <laughs> oh, wake up with the uppercut. Again. And again. Hey, if it's working. Why not? Some strings here. Yeah, nice pressure. Absolutely. Tony's trying to get back to a more comfortable range. Oh, oh. so Tyrant gets right back in. So good Slowly spacing, chasing down. Yeah, good spacing by Tony there. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, good read on the timing. That timing was perfect. Dude. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is what I was talking about. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, man. That is... That one is hilarious. It's very, it's very precise. You know, yeah. that, that cut. It's called like T Rex, but it's spelled like W R E Z. Yeah, so clever. Good stuff from another round there. Now, 2 2 0. We, we've seen some moments from Tony where it looks like he's starting to take control, where he looks like he's starting to move well, but uh, then Tyrant just gets in. He gets he gets those moments to, to get in. There we go. Tyrant starts off the match really well, but once again, that, that jump kick puts him into the corner. Okay, here's Tony now. Starts low. Let's see this combo. Beautiful. Okay, yeah, ends in grab. Now he's gonna get the mix-up. Tyrant oh, just no. armors out. Oh, this is the first ground pound we've seen. Those are not cancelable anymore, which is interesting. That was a lot of uh, Tyrant's pressure game, you know, in MK9. Uh, like the, the ground pound mind games. Right. Yeah, not, not so much of a thing here. No. Oh, oh whiff punish, there you what go. What a beautiful backdash there. That's it, I, I really like uh, MKX for for Tyrant because he is a character loyalist, but he effectively has three, you know, sort of three characters that he can pick from while being a character loyalist. I feel right. like that really plays to his strength. A lot of the players have been talking about that too. It, it is actually really cool. Oh, phew, I love the run to get back in. <laughs> Just stuffing those those pokes from Tony. Okay, overhead. That's worked pretty consistently. Oh man, the pressure. Oh, just jumps oh, out. Hey, it, at least he's out. At least he's out. Mid screen. No, Tyrant's, Tyrant's in. right in there. Just relentless. Yeah. Oh, he oh, held it. Oh, he paused it. Convinced Tony T to jump over the fireballs. What he was expecting, but instead he got hit by the fireball that Jax had held. So 3-0. 3-0 Tyrant. So Tony definitely needs to make some adjustments here. I hope he's, uh, hope he's not losing confidence. He can definitely come back. Uh, the rounds have been fairly close. Yeah, a, a, bun a bunch of them have been pretty close.
You know, he, he's, try, he's tried to EX out of pressure a couple of times, mostly on wake up, but, uh, you know, Tyrant has just had those reads. He's blocked yeah. each of them. Yeah, he's, he saw him coming. I think Tony may have gotten one. So right back into the corner. Okay, this time the block, but no punish. Oh, beautiful. A little late. Oh, we're trying to just play footsies with uppercut. Doesn't work out. Oh, wow. All right, Tyra getting back in. Tony turns it around. Okay. Maybe back a chance here corner. for Tony. Get to the corner. No. Wasn't expecting the jump. <laughs> They're switching sides quite a bit here. All right. Well, this is now exactly what Tyra wants. No, yep. not for long. Yeah, Tony's um, doing a much better job of preventing the, that corner pressure. Yeah, he is. But, you know, that, that said, Tyrant has just consistently chased down. There's the anti-air, finally. Yeah. Uh, against so many jump kicks, I think he's wanted to get that uppercut, but this one works out. Right when he needed it to. Okay, see, so he Once tried again. it again. Yeah, yeah. didn't work. So, it seems that Tony figured that out uh, <laughs> in the last couple of days. That, that works against Tyrant. Well, that's if, if so, I mean, that's definitely something to try consistently. Yeah. Overhead. Forces Tony to break. Yeah, but unfortunately, he's just right back in the corner. Really no better. Oh, look at that damage! Oh, that's EX, it. is that that's it? it? Wow, that was a chunk! Oh. <laughs> and if, if you don't mash, it doesn't do anything. Yeah. <laughs> All in a day's work. It's a tyrant fatality there. Well, it's really not looking good for Tony. Yeah, he definitely needs to... I don't think I saw him working with any other variations or any of the characters at no, all. No, he, he told me that he looked a little bit into the other variations, didn't really like them that much. Okay. He found. He said he found a lot of you know nice combos, nice, uh, sort of like nice pressure opportunities with with this one. It seems like he's applying it well though. Shift I think, damage, you know. Yeah, he was worried about uh, just being able to move around in the space, you know, against someone with the um, pressure capabilities of Tyron. And I think. Well, look, he's got to make a very very big adjustment at this point. He's down, zero four. Tyron is looking like he just has control. Yeah, absolutely. Very consistently following up, pressuring. Even when you know those, there are those opportunities you talked about where you know, they're sort of jumping in and out of the corner. Yeah. Neither one has has uh, has the corner. It always ends up with Tyrant having that situation that he needs. Yeah, he can do a lot more work in mid screen um, in Mortal Kombat X. Jax um, yes. previously in MK9 had almost just really poor damage mid screen, and then of course he had the 100% reset combos that Tyrant was great at. So now he he doesn't necessarily have to push you to the corner, and that's where he doesn't you know to get all his damage. Like he can do it mid screen now. So, Raiden also high damage output. Looks like we're getting into it. Okay. Fight. Well, we'll see if he makes that big adjustment that he needs to make. All right, okay, that works. starts off. Just throw it out. Gets that bar. Still in Thunder like Okay, very insistent. Overhead. Okay, let's see what he can do. Here it comes. Keeps it going. Okay, there's the reset. There's the overhead Gets again. The reset. Again, the reset. Oh, oh the drop, though. Oh. Can he get the rest? No. Oh, now he's in Back to the bad news. Okay, there oh, it is. Uppercuts man. underneath the projectile. <laughs> that was a great round by Tony. That was dominant. It actually. was. That was great. Yeah. Maybe something to build on. Nice juggle. Yeah. Oh, man. All right, after so many highs, he goes low. Oh, yeah. see? Tyrant respects it, and he gets thrown. Right. There's the wake up out. Oh, Tyrant baited that for sure. All right, good screen. And Tyrant being cautious about the approach. Yeah, he's playing a lot more. A lot more cautious for sure. Oh, that was a, such a and good. And he gets it again. I, I, oh, I love that whip punish. He punished the the ground pound. Yeah, good reaction there. Oh! Oh! Oh, does that work? That was insane. I know. I was thinking the same thing. If he could have converted that, that'd been pretty uh, swaggy. Okay. Oh, Tyrant's in. Yeah, Tyrant. Push. Pressuring. He sees that there's no meter on Tony T's side. Maybe time to pressure. Oh! Not quite it. Needs one more hit of chip. Yep. There it is. He caught oh, him in the air. In the air. And he's got a fatality, right? Absolutely. <laughs> oh, man. Well, could we see a comeback? It's going to take a lot to make that comeback. It's 3-1 okay, th right now, but, right? There's some, there's some consideration from Tyrant. I did see him play other variations. Okay. Well, it doesn't go, doesn't go to that yet. He still has quite a few left. Absolutely. Oh, it's 4 1 So yeah. this is. Yeah, he's in dire straits here right now, is, is Tony. Absolutely. Stand. Oh, tried for it. Bates it. Back into the corner. Let's see the mix up here. Okay, low. Yeah. 
overhead. Just gets out. Ooh, he respected it. Yeah. And here's Tyrant just still pressuring, slowly taking life off. Okay. Forces Tyrant to break now. There's that oh. jump kick again. Turns it around. Ooh. Tyrant right. jumping out. He jumps now he, out yeah. yeah, I mean, it's, it's worked a lot. Why not? No, that hasn't worked at all. Okay. And the knee for the win. Well, it's match point now for Hitbox Tyrant. Match point. Sit down, match point. Let's go. Okay, jumped out of the air, yes. Now he has the corner. Delay wake up. There's gonna be the restand. What's Tony's option here? He's, he has meter, doesn't spend it. Oh, nice. so Tyrant very smartly knows, goes in. Yeah. And that's pretty safe too, the dash. Point. All right, oh, comes goes in. Too. Comes in. Oh, but Tyrant. Oh, uh -oh. here's the big chance for Tyrant. Uh -oh. Lots of damage on the table. No, it doesn't take too much. Just jumps out again for free. Tony with pressure. Tyrant Not just, too much, yeah. yeah. Tyrant just pressuring out of the corner again. Oh, the knee holds him back. Wow, <laughs> wake up, uppercut. Tony has a good Oh, look at right the chip, now. look at the chip. Oh! <laughs> Tony can't Good believe that that worked. <laughs> I saw his face. He's actually smiling right now, yeah. yeah. That was awesome. So, gets him in the corner right away. <laughs> He's not going to let him out for free. Oh, good that juggle. That was sick. Yeah. yeah. Oh, he tries for the juggle. And this is this is real bad news for Tony right now. Tyrant has the corner. But look, at there's X-Ray on Tony's side. Oh, the grab. So, he, yeah, he could break. Oh, he oh, just, just straight up X-Ray. This is one of my favorites. This one's super cool. It's very different than the others. It is. So what can he build on here? He has the corner. The damage is pretty oh, good Oh, <laughs> not much. And then he just comes right in. There's Tyrant. And Tyrant seals the deal. Five games to one. Congrats to him. He's going to move on. And Tony T, unfortunately for him, is going to go back home. But you know what? He came here from Australia. He wanted to represent well. He took a game. He wasn't completely shut out. Absolutely. And I, I know considering how nervous he was that, you know, I think I think he's probably feeling all, a lot better about that now. I was impressed. I was really impressed by his gameplay. He um, he didn't look nervous to me at all uh, while he was playing. He was hitting some good combos, making smart decisions. Um, but, man, that, that uh, pressure game from Tyrant, those mix-ups, uh, a little bit too much for him. So... Yeah, there, there was a game where it seemed like Tony was starting to adapt by going into the air a little bit more. Yeah. Um, you know, getting some, some of those juggles into the, into the Superman, into the corner. But it just it, it, it didn't seem like he could consistently make that happen. Right, right. And, um, yeah, he started turning around. Those, uh, those jump kicks were stuffing all of uh, Tyrant's yeah. anti-air attempts. Uh, he was starting to um, push him out of the corner. Guys, it looks like uh, Josh is on stage with the winner, so we're going to send it over to him. Thank you very much, gentlemen. Congratulations, Hitbox Tyrant, moving on into the semifinals, guaranteeing $500. Your fans are going nuts out here in SoCal. First of all, that corner combo coming from Jax, 40% damage. How long did it take you to learn that? Uh, honestly, it took me like like 15 minutes. <laughs> it, was, uh, it was pretty easy. Um, like I said, Jax is very pretty up front as far as his combos and stuff so yeah definitely up front with those combos and also that fatality as well the crowd loved that those rating combos are coming from tony t by the way give it up for tony t from australia he is an artist when it comes to combos and stay tuned for more videos coming from him on youtube but the amount of combos in that guessing game he was playing how are you able to overcome that Oh, man, Tony, if there's one thing Tony T is really good at is finding really, really dirty stuff to where it's like you feel you just feel helpless. So for a moment, honestly, I just guessed right. But uh, yeah, unfortunately, it's just, that's just how it goes. But he's still a phenomenal player. And, you know, he, he still has a lot to learn. But I mean, you know, practice comes with that. He's got it. He's definitely got it. But especially with that footwork, you guys did not have an engagement for a little bit. How are you able to anticipate the right moment in order to punish his first engagement? Um, well, the good thing about MKX is uh, they actually changed the mechanics to where they have the run mechanic. And in my opinion, I think that's going to be really important in the long run in terms of footsies. And um, I, just, I saw him advancing forward, so, you know, I used my normals with Jax to, to whiff punish him in, so. All right, Hitbox Tyrant, anything else you'd like to say to everybody here and everybody watching around the world? Um, go America. <laughs> USA! 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 
We're gonna get ready with our next matchup. Stay tuned. The ESL Mortal Kombat X Fatal 8 Exhibition Tournament continues, presented by Xbox, after this.